Okay, how are you doing today guys? My name is Mike with Crandall Office Furniture and in this video we will show you how to properly lubricate a steel case and a chair. Now I do have the seat removed. The seat removal is the same process as the seat removal on a steel case leap chair. So now we'll have the seat off, we'll go ahead and show you the points we want to lubricate on the chair. So we are using WD-40 silicone spray. We like to use this because it tends to be less messy and does not stink as much as the uh, traditional WD-40. Okay, so with the seat removed, you want to hit the main spring of the chair back here, and you can also access the spring through this front hole. So we're just going to spray some silicone spray to coat the spring in the front and the back. So just a couple squirts here, and then we'll come around to the back. You can be generous with the lube, it shouldn't affect the function. And a couple sprays across the spring. Okay, so now that we have some lubrication on the springs, we want to flex the chair back to distribute the lube into the spring fully. So let's grab the back and a few flexes on it. And the creak should go away. If it still creaks, hit a few more spots with the lube, should be good to go. All right, guys, so that's how you properly lubricate your steel case EMEA chair. If you have any questions or have any concerns, feel free to reach out to us at CrandallOffice.com. Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching this quick tutorial. If you found this video helpful, please make sure to click the like and subscribe buttons below. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to us at CrandallOffice.com or on our Facebook page.